Oh, so man. Oh, yeah. yeah. I know you're here. Yeah, just hanging out. Okay, I'm gonna head out for a little bit and do some errands. Uh, oh, before I forget, uh, a few mornings ago, I was kind of in a rush on my way to work, and I may have stolen just a little bit of your coffee. Um, I hope that's okay. Yeah, don't worry about it. It's actually, it's gonna make me feel better because a couple days ago, I ran out of toilet paper in my bathroom, and so I had to sneak a roll from yours, so. I apologize. <laughs> it's totally fine. Whatever you need it. Um, I guess since we're doing like roommate confessions, uh, I was getting a little peckish a couple nights back and my ice cream is gone, so I may have taken the last words. Um, it wasn't much left, so I figured it wouldn't matter. Uh, oh, my Stephen Colbert's Americone Dream? My happy food? Okay. Okay, okay, cool, 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 cool. Uh, well, let me then just tell you that I may have used your toothbrush. But you have yours. I saw it next to the sink. Oh, no, not like that. I mean, you remember when the shower was clogged, right? I said the coat hanger wasn't working and we should go by Drano. And then before you went to go get the Drano, I said, wait, 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 never mind. I took care of it. Oh, that's, yeah. that's how you, okay. I fixed the problem. Mm-hmm. You shitting me? I am not. Hmm. When was that? Oh, that was weeks ago, John. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I guess I should probably give you a heads up then. Um, you know I'm in that swim league over the summer? Mm hmm Yeah, well, we just did finals, obviously. I was worried I wasn't going to win, so I wanted to give myself kind of, you know, an edge. Uh, so I took steroids before the race, so. Okay, well that one just seems like more of a you thing. Mm-hmm. I see it would be, but we won because of me taking the steroids. So obviously we had a huge summer swim league party afterwards. It got crazy. I ended up taking a lot more drugs. Congratulations. I don't know what you want me to say here. Mm, you don't have to say anything. I just wanted to tell you that that was the night before the Thursday when you asked me. When I asked you for a urine sample for my job interview? You know, I had urine to give, and I wanted to be helpful, so I was like, yeah, I'll give him that. I was only worried about marijuana. What was in your system? <sighs> well, the steroids. Yeah, obviously. The drug we did the most of was this, uh, this one called Jesus's Monster Truck. You heard of it? No! Well, that is pretty new. Um, that was the big one. Okay, well then, if it's new, then they probably won't test for it, right? Oh yeah, they have no idea it exists. <laughs> oh, thank God. I mean, obviously, they will find the cocaine, the marijuana, uppers, downers, the molly. They'll find all of that, so. <laughs> okay. Well then, on Tuesday, having a pretty rough day. Mm. A lot of people giving me attitude. I wanted to call my mom. She was at work. So I called your mom instead. My mom, uh, okay, how do you have her number? She was very supportive. We talked for hours. I uh, do also need to tell you though, that it means I will be spending Christmas with you guys this year, so. You're coming to Christmas now. Yeah, and I feel like I'm not supposed to know this, but I'm pretty sure you're my secret Santa. All right, well, since we're there, let me just inform you of something. I recently came into possession of counterfeit bills and a lot of them. So I need to launder them, obviously. And one of the ways I've been doing that is through you. Anytime you've come home, left your wallet sitting around, I've been going in and switching out your bills, usually the big ones, uh, for my counterfeit ones. I'm almost done. I wasn't really gonna tell you, but since we're here, I figured I should, uh, I should let you know. So every time I pay in cash, I'm risking going to prison? Oh yeah, especially considering where those counterfeit bills came from. Yeah, yeah it's gonna be a long sentence. Hmm, well, I didn't want to have to go here, John, but you <sighs> really left me no choice. So, let me ask if you remember when you had to put your dog down. Max? But he had rings. There's nothing to do with him. Who do you think gave him the rabies, John? I love that dog, of course. Well, probably as much as you loved your brother. 
You know the one. Who was involved in that bank robbery. Was about to surrender to police, but right as he was about to, one of the snipers took him out. What are you saying, John? Who do you think told him to take the shot, Chris? I would assume someone on the police force, John. Or someone who still had their SWAT team commander costume from Halloween, 1998. Well... I forgive you. Okay. I forgive you. I mean, I really, I can see where you were coming from on all of those. Yeah. Same. <laughs> I mean, we gotta be on good terms if you're coming to Christmas. Oh yeah, you wanna make sure your secret Santa gift is good. <laughs> yeah. Oh god, I gotta go. Um, but... I'll be back later. Just gotta run a bunch of errands. Uh, yeah, just, okay. Just gonna be hanging out or... Yeah, I'll probably take a nap right here or something. Okay. Cool. Well, I'll uh, see you later. All right. Oh, I am uh, parked in front of you, though. So, motherfucker!